and welcome. I'm Emily Cloak and I'm presenting the awards tonight. We are proud to announce that this is the first annual Northern Ireland Wedding Award. It's being held in the lovely Europa Hotel and we're here to award and celebrate all our nominees. We've got wonderful people here tonight, all dressed in press and hopefully they'll have a great night. Well Peter, congratulations, how do you feel? Um, ecstatic, I didn't expect it at all so it's amazing to win the award yet. Wonderful, it's, it's a great award and just such a good night. How do you feel? What are you going to, any plans for the rest of the evening or are you just going to celebrate? Just celebrate. It's happened at the start of the evening so I'm going to have a very good night now so it's going to be great. Yeah. Well Gareth, congratulations. How do you feel? Ecstatic. Um, definitely wasn't expecting this tonight but... So tell me a bit about your award then. What's it? What was it for? Um, we do the disco and entertainment for the night. So we keep everyone dancing into the small hours of the morning. But as well as just supplying the disco and the music, we do everything and besides entertain the kids, we do photographs, photo booths. So really what we're about is entertainment for everyone. So it's so much more than just the music. Well, congratulations, ladies. Tell us a bit about the award. We are so overwhelmed to win this. Um, myself and Alison have been working in Charm for six years now and we dress venues all over Northern Ireland and it's our life. Yeah, really we, we put so much into it and um, it just means so much. Thank you so much. What's the award called? Um, the Event Decorator of the Year. Wonderful. That's yeah. Awesome. I know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's such a big part of people's day and as the years have went on, it really is a big part of people's day that the decoration of the venue is yeah. really does set the tone for the day and it's such an amazing part for me and Alison to be part of the day. Well, Rebecca, congratulations. How are you feeling? It's so good, yeah. Tell us a bit about your award. Uh, well, this is the Bridal Makeup Artist Specialist of the Year, um, and I'm totally shocked right now because <laughs> there was so much competition, so many good people in it, so yeah. Belfast is a small place and there's a lot of makeup artists, isn't there? But your makeup's gorgeous tonight. Well done, Kira. How do you feel? Thank you so much. I feel amazing. So tell us a bit about your award then. Um, I won Wedding Coordinator of the Year, so I'm really happy about that. I was up against a lot of um, competition, so I'm very privileged to have received the award. Wonderful, wonderful. So what's your everyday job then? Um, well, I coordinate a lot of events and weddings all throughout Northern Ireland and Republic of Ireland. So um, I, I'm very, I really enjoy my job, I really enjoy what I do. So Paul, congratulations. Tell me a bit about your award. Well, we won an award for 2016 uh, Groomswear Specialist of the Year Northern Ireland Wedding Awards. So we're I'm sure you are. So where are you located then? We're located in Newry, County Down. Uh, we do a lot of trade from County Down, County Armagh, down into Louth and Monaghan. Okay. Do you have an online shop? No, we don't have an online shop. We would encourage people to visit the store, see our selection, see our range. Feel the real thing then, right? Thing yes. Right on, yeah. Any big plans this year? Yeah, we, well, we're going to use the award, utilise the award for our marketing, etc. And at the minute, it's, it's booking season for people getting married in the spring and summer, so couldn't have came at a better time. So, Andrea, how, how do you feel? I'm so excited. I can't believe we've actually won. Wonderful. No, it's great. Because we're just a small, small venue. So tell me a bit about your, your business then. Belisle Castle is very small. Our maximum number of guests for a wedding is just 60. And it's fantastic even to be nominated, but to win the award is just fantastic. You're overwhelmed, I see, definitely. I can't believe it. It's brilliant. And what's the name of your award? And the most romantic venue. Romantic. The most romantic. So what makes you stand out from the rest of the venues there? The castle alone on its own. So when you rent out the castle for a wedding, you have the whole island to yourself. Well done, Katrina and Maria. How are you feeling? Oh, we're absolutely delighted. Um, the Everglades Hotel, in conjunction with Perfect Bliss Wedding Events, um, we organise two wedding fairs every year and they're a great success. Well, Lisa, tell me about your award. What's it called? Um, it's for Wedding Stationery Supplier of the Year and it's the regional award this year. And where are you based? I'm based in Belfast. Okay. Um, so, uh, but I actually work for lots of brides all over Northern Ireland. Tell me your everyday work then. Um, I create beautiful stationery, um, which would also include reception stationery, which means table plans, name place cards, order of service, so the whole sort of stationery supplies. So Pat, tell me about your award. Um, I'm delighted it's an accessory award and actually this is from Jordan on the Lisbon Road and we really cater for the mother of the bride and bridal accessories. And how much does this award mean to you? It's a great deal. 
uh, all the staff will be delighted. Congratulations! How are you feeling? Are you all overwhelmed? Yeah, it was fantastic. Couldn't believe it. We got it like so we're well pleased. Yeah. Were you expecting this award tonight? Not a chance. No, no. There was... Are you just being? No, 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 no. There was a lot of competitors there. We're well pleased to get it like so we're brilliant. Absolutely. Where do you, where are you based? Or are you all over Northern Ireland? Well, more or less Newry area, Newcastle, around that area. We do like you know that southern area, so we're well pleased to be doing that there and happy enough to get this, you know. So Danielle, congratulations, and to the rest of the team, obviously. Can you tell me a bit about your award? Um, we won best jewellers um, in Northern Ireland. Fantastic. So is that? Tell me what your range from then. Well, we specialise in wedding rings and engagement rings, okay. um, and bespoke diamond jewellery. And we're celebrating our 30th anniversary this year, oh, so it's a lovely surprise for us. Yes, definitely. So you definitely deserve it then. Yes. So you get all the big rocks in and all Well, we the... try our best. <laughs> so Charlene, tell me a bit about your award. Oh, I'm just in absolute shock. I can't believe it. I'm just shaking and delighted. You weren't expecting it at all? Oh, absolutely. No. I've been her death for 10 years and <gasps> just can't believe it. And it's your own business? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Where are you located? We're in Newcastle, Newcastle in County right. Down. Yes. Right. And do you get a lot of business down there? We do a lot of weddings through hotels and sleeve honoured and stuff. And what makes you stand out from the crowd then? Just our loyal customers and we do a lot of just we work through hotels in Newcastle as well. So Well done, tell me how do you feel after winning this amazing award? I totally shocked. <laughs> the award is for Wedding Cake Designer of the Year. So, and I've been in business for three years, I'm just absolutely delighted. It's the first award I've ever won, and I just, I'm shocked. Thank you. And you, do you make the cakes yourself? Oh yes, I make everything myself. I make all the sugar flowers, and yeah, deliver from consultation to delivery. So Graham, how are you feeling? Very good, thank you very much, very good. Were you expecting the award at all? Uh, no, not at all. No? Definitely not at all. So how long have you been running your business for? Nine years. Nine years? And you just wanted to call it your name then to stick out? Uh, yes, no, no, it's easy to Google. It is easy to Google. People know how to contact you anyway. <laughs> so Gary, congratulations. Are you overwhelmed? Totally. Totally. Wasn't expecting it at all, but delighted. Perfect. And where are you based then? Barnbridge, in Barnbridge. County Down. Wonderful. And tell me about your company then. Are you self-run? I just work for myself, yes, yeah. and I've been going over 10 years now. Wow. So I've done hundreds of weddings. And what makes you stand out from the rest of them then? Just to put 100% into every wedding. Well, Sinead, are you over the moon? I'm absolutely delighted. I just can't believe it. I tell me the name of your award. Um, Florist of the Year. Wow. And how long have you been doing that for? Um, 11 years this year, um, in March. And I took it up after my mum had died at the age of 51, just to take my mind off her. And uh, it's worked into a career and it's a booming business. It's blooming. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> Such a lovely thing to do. And did your mum love flowers? Great gardener. She loved her garden, so she did. You're brought up doing that then, obviously. So how are you feeling about winning such an amazing award? Well, I have to say, I um, uh, um, can't really believe it, but... Uh, um, I don't actually have any words to describe it, but I have to say, if it wasn't, well, I brought the whole thing over from South Africa and uh, um, I, everybody just shot it down and just thought it's not going to work because it's a very outdoor South African sunshine thing and uh, after starting it. And you know what, it's proved to be... Um, Tell me a bit about your business then. Yeah, we do a, a South African style event catering and uh, um, you know, it's a very different, completely outside of the box type of catering not the usual what people is used to so uh, um, it's been very very tough to get people to understand it but uh, it's been seven as well so Shelley and the girls how are you feeling over the moon over the moon uh, even in our regional category yeah it's really really tough I think the toughest one I was over the moon to win really didn't think we would so tell me about your business um, we've been open for nearly seven years now uh, I started it from home um, it's just myself and we opened where we are now five years ago and it's just slowly grew and grew. Um, we really, really focus on customer service and, and I think that's why we are here. Well, it pays off for sure. Absolutely, yeah. What's the name of your company? Divinity Bridal. Mm -hmm. What made you call it that then? Uh, really just brainstorming when I first opened the business. Um, just trying to think of everything, uh, words that described perfection and then everything divine as Pamela said upstairs and that sort of thing and that's where it came from. Yeah. Okay. Well done, Kathy. Are you all a team here tonight? Yes, very, very much a team, yeah. Chris is a guy who actually owns Strina. He runs Strina. And I'm his manager, and Joanne is the wedding planner. Wonderful. Well, you're dressed for the occasion anyway tonight. All glitz and glam. What a lovely evening. Oh, it's been amazing. Really, really exciting. Neil 
nail-biting right up until the very, very I'm end. Sure, I'm sure. Uh -huh. Do you know you were nominated for this award? We did know we were nominated, but never thought for one moment that we would ever win it. It was nearly like too much of a witch, yeah. or wish. Yeah. So absolutely delighted. Well, that wraps up a lovely evening, and I hope to see you all next year, 2017, at the Northern Ireland Wedding Awards.